Right. I'm supposed to be recording this. Whoops, you missed a conversation about how Oppie is far away from us. And she is intentionally hiding because she doesn't want people to interact with her. My bad. <laughs> Whoops. I forgot to hit record. I'm bad at video gaming. So we're going to go to G8. And I also got a snack. Okay. Let's see. Toggle Legend. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. I'm covering up a lot of it, but it's not too bad. So, fuel density is okay. Anomaly density, like, these aren't terrible. It says no resource density, but a low building density. Hmm. All right, well, we've decided to go here, so we're going here. I mean, anyway, I'm having fun with this. It is very chill, though. Like, I definitely don't feel like this is the kind of game that, like... Like, I think it was a bad thing to start playing during the, uh, the stream anniversary. Just on virtue of, like... Uh, how do I want to put this? Um, how do I want to put this? Doing really long streams like that, it was really easy for me to, like, just fall asleep. You know? And when I'm trying to not fall asleep, that's, uh, oof. Um, but doing it, like, now, when I'm not trying to not fall asleep, it's not too the terrible. The Octavice needs different charge levels to overcome the conditions for a gateway. You'll have to feed anchors to the Octavice until it's satisfied, and she'll tell you how many she needs at any given time. Okay. Um, but yeah, so like, I think the problem was trying to do this during the long streams and I was going to easily fall asleep. Going to the gate, good luck, thank you. Transmission Fragment Arda, Dispatch Headquarters, April 26, good 1964. <gasps> good night, boy! Thank you for hanging out. Hey! This is Anna! I'm totally going so fast right now! Oh no, oh no! It's happening again! Just out collecting some data from the weather stations, and oh no, there are these new things out here, and oh hell, if you touch them, you, ah, no, hold on, Charlie, look, I'm not an engineer or a pharmacist, I'm a meteorologist, but my guess is these things are discharging huge amounts of energy into whatever they touch, and when they hit a car, you totally go so fast, hold on, Charlie. You can never go back. Discarded, like us. Oh, interesting. Francis, the remnants are like us in a way. Those of us who chose to stay behind were as discarded and forgotten as they are. And by chose to stay, you mean actively defying government orders to evacuate? Then yes, you, you remember how we went without electricity for four months to dodge cl the clearing crews. That's what, only a hundred of us left? There's what, only a hundred of us left? If even that. Frankly, I'm surprised so many of us were unable to move on for one reason or another. Speak for yourself, I'm here for the hunt. Even better now, no one's to get in our way. Interesting. Survive. Driver, not to be a downer or nothing, but I'm wondering what we do if you can't find a way out of the zone. They got themselves over the wall, they'll find a way to survive here like the rest of us. Or not, it won't be my problem at that point. I'd hardly call what we're doing here surviving. Both of you! Always going on and on about putting up with us, enduring that. There's more to life than that, you know? You, for example, Oppie. You're brilliant. You control the fundamental forces of nature with your fingertips. Both of you did. Slow down there, kid. We're scientists, not superheroes. To someone who is all thumbs when it came to science, they're one and the same. I just don't understand why you're wasting away here, burrowed away in the zone. Both of you, you're sitting on so much lost potential. Potential is a carrot on a stick for the young, an illusion to keep you for forging forging on when you should have given up long ago. Nothing had more potential than LAM technology, and look what it did to the Olympic Peninsula. What I did. Look around, we're stuck here, for good. All we can do is survive. Everything else is moot. I forget what a charmer you are, Oppie. An absolute living ray of sunshine and optimism. Alright, let's go. Okay, chat, let's go for a drive. Dr -dr -dr drive. Oh. 
you fucking bonk me? Oh. Bonk. Ow, 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 ow. Listen, I need the resources video game. Yeah, 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 you're mad at me. I know. The video game doesn't like it when I do this shit. It gets mad at me for following, like, the gameplay loop, you know? Alright. I do like that I have this extra storage, though. It's pretty nice. Oops. I accidentally turned the car off instead of on. Alright, let's get the fuck away from this thing. No. No. Get away from me. Jerk ass motherfucker. Hey, hey, hey. Fuck off. Fuck off. Fuck off. I'm busy driving here. I'm driving here. You asshole. I need to stop for that. What I do need to do is turn on this road. Where is this road? Almost there. No one likes impromptu tow truck, right? I certainly don't. Let me out. I'm just going to stop at these two houses here. These two little houses. You know what I do want? I want a flare. Because I don't have night vision, chat. If I did have night vision, it would make this all easier, but... I don't. So I have to do this the hard way with my fucking eyeballs. Okay. Can run over to this tower. Here, so Mr. Flying tow truck, we already raided. I mean, fix <laughs> that tower. Right? Exactly. All right, bonking time. All right, that can stay there. I think. <clears throat> Pry this open. All right, you know what? Okay. Um, can I smash these like with the smasher? Oh, I can. That's way faster. All right, cool. Gears to what? Gears to duct tape? Eh. Oh, I'm like dying. I'm I'm dying, chat. I need to get back. I gotta get back to the car. I gotta get back to the car. I didn't realize my health was tanking. Shit, shit, shit. I gotta go. I gotta go. Okay, see, it's fine. Okay. All right, I don't think, we, like, we can just backtrack and go to this one, I think, so. We will back up. Ah, much better. Okay, I'm, I'm back to, like, full. Oh, there's a car there. Hold on a second, there's a car. I saw a car. You have anything, anything good? I would like to crowbar you, please. It's a fucking bunny. 
Hey, 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 get off my car. Jerk. Stupid bunny. Attacking my goddamn car. No! Oh, it grabbed the bunny instead! That's fucking hilarious. I bet it's pissed. It grabbed the bunny instead. Haha, <laughs> get fucked. Dice? That's Are they playing D and D? That's not great at all. Um, uh, it, it knocks you over and begins to advance towards Taffy. Um, and as it is, it takes a second and it extends a long clawed hand or arm or whatever the thing is. And Taffy strikes out at you. Can you make a Constitution saving throw? They're playing D and D chat. Uh, well, I'm back a little like, really bad today. <laughs> Knocked down. Uh, Taffy, your character starts to, to actually throw up, and uh, and Justin, you're you are you are really feeling some bruises there, my guy. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I I cast um summon stinking cloud. <laughs> Interesting. Unreliable dumpster or dumpster pearl. Unreliable. I do. Why? TK, hi. How you doing, TK? How are you today, hon? Dumpster pearl. Slice a pearl in half, and you'll find thousands of layers of precious materials formed around a core. Break one of those apart, and who knows what'll pop out. Unreliable. Shaky at best. After knocks and bangs, shocks or surprises, it's to be expected that this poor battered thing isn't quite at its best. You weren't really hoping to rely on it, were you? Hmm. Nerds, did you expect them to do in their free time? Mm, that's a fair point. That's a fair point. D&D is, is something that nerds do. You're not wrong. Chat, do you guys play D&D? Are you nerds that play D&D games? Distracting him with that, you know. I don't think he liked it. Tardigrid warning: psychic disruption may affect work. I just gotta get back to the car. I just gotta get back to the car. Wait. Jeez, does that thing talk? Oh, is that where the arc stuff is? Hold on. Oh, that thing's way the fuck out there. Alright. I guess I gotta go. Surprisingly, you need friends. I'd like to get back, but you don't wanna be the GM. You know what? That's fair. That's a fair point, hon. I know, I'm sorry. All right, I gotta get this arc energy. This is super dangerous. I don't know... I don't know why I'm walking, but... Really. 
in in for a penny, in for a pound, right? Right, chat? In for a penny, in for a pound? Yoink! We gotta go, 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 we gotta go, we gotta go, we gotta go. Run, 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 run. I don't know where I parked, I forget. It was this way? Yeah, it was to the left of the house. It's fine, it's fine. We're just running, 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 we're just running. Slide over the car door. Pound this pan script. God damn it, Jeff. Okay. All right, let's keep on keeping on, shall we? Let's keep on keeping on. We're just gonna drive our merry little way down and stop whenever we see a car, real quick. Now. Nothing. Shiza. Hi, Tibby. Hi, Lesbiana. We talking how much we'd be down to fucking it is hot. Wait. I'm the one who does the fucking. I'm the fucker, not the fucky. What are you talking about? Didn't you know? How you feeling, Tibbo? How you feeling today? Michael made homemade cookies with the scratch butter, and I think I had a religious experience. Hey, yo. Hell yeah. Good shit. I love to hear that. I love to hear that. That is awesome of you. Or for you, I guess. I mean, just in general. Uh, would you let Sigourney Weaver peg you? I don't, I don't think you have a. Ch I don't think I have a choice in the matter. If Sigourney Weaver's gonna peg you, you just get pegged. What are you gonna? Do? What are you gonna do? Are you gonna say no to Ripley? Come on. In a group setting, there is enough fucking for. Oh my god. Oh, the storm is a stern. Okay. Well, I've been through the zone in a car with a name. I named her Frankie because it felt like it was weird she didn't have a name. Le legally distinct from, from a horse with no name, of course. Legally distinct. Gotta go grab this real fast. Man, now I want cookies. Yeah, well. I'll live. Alright, and, uh, yoink! Gotta go, gotta go, gotta go, gotta go, gotta go, 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 go. Gotta go, gotta go, gotta go, gotta go. The game does not like this. The game does not like it when I yoink, chat. give you cookies, but I give you something else to eat. It's sweet to eat. Uh -huh. Wrong. Do I need to start flirting with Chad again and getting in trouble? I called Frisk a good boy earlier and I did it with the mommy voice. I even turned the blush on.
no sheet. Nothing bad can come of flirting. You think my world is professional? Oh no. Yeah, nothing bad will ever come of it. Alright, I gotta go. I gotta go. I gotta leave. I gotta leave. Hey! Wait. Happy hair? What's a happy hair? Okay, I'll, I'll read that in a minute once I'm once I'm not you know, fleeing for my life. Okay. Give me some good coming though. Mmm. Ooh. Tasty. Wait. Tasty. Alright, so we need to go to this junction and then we we'll turn left. And then we just follow the road up to the exit. We got plenty of time. The storm is not moving very fast. I think we got plenty of time. Assuming you don't run into it. What the fuck is that? This is a very long drive. <laughs> oh man. I don't know. Do you guys like it when I tease you? When I do like the flirty tease chat? Is that is that something you guys like? Is it something I want you guys to like? Speaking of flirting, hello code, nya raid. Hello code, welcome in raiders. My name is Hanetto, your local idiot cat girl. This is literally dumb shit and ends up regretting it later. How are you doing today, dear? How is your stream? Um, question, 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 question. Uh, congratulations on hitting 5K, dear. Things went well, awesome. Cat girl to cat girl communication. Listen, okay, listen, listen. Chat, chat, listen to me. Okay, you will understand, okay? You're gonna understand. Do you know why? Because look at these fucking abs. Look at them, look at them. We follow, we follow the 80s sex and violence cat girl by being buff as fuck. You see? You see? Look at these. these. These are not abs that are textured on. These have a physical mesh to them. These are actual abs. Also, fun fact. Check these fucking shoulders out, guys. Look at these. Look at these fucking shoulders that I can rock out. Yeah? Yeah? Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Look at these fucking shoulders, chat. Got the 2x2 two two Minecraft grid. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Alright, let me get back into position. I don't put my jacket back on. Actually, fuck it. I'm gonna put the cool sunglasses on. Very good. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, everybody, if you aren't already, please go follow Code Channel. Absolutely fan fuck. Fan fucking tastic person to vibe to. Plays a lot of retro games and does achievement hunting. And uh, like I said, is is an '80s big hair sex and violence cat girl. So if you are not already following her, you absolutely should be. She is wonderful. Thank you, hun. Thank you. I hope you had a wonderful stream tonight. I hope you had a wonderful stream. I'm having some fun, just kind of vibing with my driving. You know, listen to some good music. Drive-in. I got the grid. Oh my god, Sabsy. How specific drive-in? It's a very vibe game. Like, I like it, but it's very, very vibe. Like, I started playing it when I was doing my, um, my big marathon streams, and it was kind of like, ooh, that's a lot of shit. Uh, it was enough to kind of put me to sleep, so it's definitely the kind of game that, like, you know? You know? Um... <gasps> No, Fornelli. Fornelli, yeah, thank you for the follow. Um, it's, it's, like, it's a very calming game, I guess, is the way to put it. Like, yeah, there's a couple of moments of, like, ah, shit, I gotta go! But for the most part, it's kind of, you know, a good old-fashioned, like, drive around, collect resources, work on the quests, make your car better, drive around again. The gameplay loop is pretty simple, um, but I'm having fun with it so far. I'm having fun with it. It definitely has those tense moments of like, ah shit, ah shit, everything's fine, it's fine, we gotta go, we gotta go, we gotta go, we gotta go. 
it's fine, but we gotta go, we gotta go, we gotta go. Um, but for the most part, it's, it's pretty good. Sometimes, you know, you want just like a, a calming game that you can hang out with. You just have to worry about the occasional thing, like, attacking. It's fine. Oh shit, there's a car in the fucking road here, what the hell? And shit like that, you know? But yeah! Okay, listen, go, fuck off. Go away. Go away. I'm busy. <laughs> I'm busy. Um, but yeah, a lot of collect resource. Grab, grab and go. Sort of thing. I'm having fun with it, though. Um, I kind of let chat decide today what we should do, so they ch they picked it. It was either this or, you know, play some Isaac or something. Oh, is that another anomaly? Oh, that's a tree in the road! Shit! Um, I'm gonna have to go around this tree, I guess. It's fine, it's fine. Code Mom's up, so I'll have to catch up with her, so have a great one. Alright, hello, love in the new look. Thank you so much for bringing your community in, hon. I really appreciate it. Tell Code Mom I said hi. I hope she's doing well. Thank you so much for stopping in. Everybody, please go follow Code Channel. Okay? Go. Do it. But have a great night. We gotta, we gotta hurry and get ahead of this storm anyway. Absolutely, thank you, hon. Do I have time? I got. I, okay, if there wasn't an anomaly, I, I mean, I could. Alright, let's let's head to the next part of the zone, shall we? Let's head to the. We'll head to the next zone. It's fine. We're gonna skip one house that I could have gone to, but it's it's. Um, dead end, do not enter. All right, I guess we'll go here then. Maximum number of houses, a low radiation, and hold on. Well, anomaly density is kind of meh. Zone storm is kind of meh. There's not a lot of vehicles. There's no resources, but radiation and atmospheric shifts are low, and there's a lot of houses. Okay, we can go here. We can go here and vibe for a little gamble. All right, all right, all right. It lands it on heads. <sighs> Ooh, woo! Wait. Ooh, woo. Ooh, woo. Uh, Junction G1, Research Outpost, Artisite, Blistering Woods, Outer Zone. Junction, Extreme Conditions, Disruptive Discharge. But there are a lot of houses. So we'll just have to be a little careful. It'll be fine. So we'll head left. What did I say? No, we'll head right. And we're going to go to these houses that are down here. I'm not going to go to this one specifically because of all these fucking forests. Because goddamn, there's a fucking lot of them. Here. Is that a baller? I think that was a baller. It's fine. Alright. Um, let's stop at this house. Pop out, see what's in here, see if there's anything good. Like after that run earlier where we like ran into all the good shit, but like we couldn't take any of it because we just didn't have storage space. Feeling real greedy now because we have all the storage space that we could ever want. Because we have so much storage space now, chat. Okay. We just gotta we just gotta be aware that, you know, it's just a little rainy. just raining a little bit, right? What's what's a little rain between friends? Oh, we never read this. Oh, that was the Poetry by Tobias thing? Huh. I'll have to 
to read that at some point. Okay. Back into the car. Uh, next building is right up ahead. Alright, next building chat. Who doesn't want their empty holes filled? You know what? That's a great... Code was the first cat girl you followed? Hell yeah! Code is amazing! I'm, I'm super happy that I, I got a chance to meet Code, because it's, it's very rare that you meet, like, another, you know, sex and violence 80s cat girl. There's not a lot of us left, chat. There's not a lot of us left. Uh, is this one sealed off entirely? Well, that's rude. I came all the way out here for nothing. Alright. All the way out here for nothing. Nope, nope. I bonked myself on the head. Too breedable and came, became domesticated? I mean, kind of. Like, that's what happened to cat girls, is that, you know, they, they eventually got, like, befriended and turned into pets, and now there's not a lot of us biggins left. And therein lies the problem, is that we need more biggins. You know? We need more big bad cat girls. That's what I want. More big bad cat girls. Oh wait, friendly dumpster. How have we not scanned that already? You got anything for me, buddy? No, oh, my sucker died. Shit. My sucker died, chat. I liked that thing. <gasps> no, I don't have enough part. Wait, air can't craft this. Aw, oh, damn it. I liked the sucker, though. It was useful. It was really useful. So that I didn't have to pick everything up by hand, because I'm super lazy. I am so fucking lazy. You're gonna crash here for the night? Wait, that explains what now? Hold on. Hold on, hold on. So what you're saying is you need to spread your seed all the modern soft cat girls to make a big hard one. I feel like you're propositioning me, Lesbiana. <laughs> that explains everything. Then you're going to crash tonight. Good night, Pray Jack. Thank you for being here. Uh, your use of flares with gas pump feels unsafe. It's fine. Big bad cat girls will return now that the cute cat girl evolutionary niche is under pressure by the competing cute puppy girl species. Sex and violence cat girls have became domesticated. I mean... Listen, we can't all be fantastically amazing. Okay? Some of us some of us have to be normal. Toilet. Battery's getting low. It's okay. Is battery dead? Wait. Oh, I didn't turn car on. I turned key, did not wait until key was done. So car was not on. Oh, that's a... Is that for ramping? That's sick. Mm. 
No! Is that another goddamn tree in the road? Motherfuck. Why is it always a tree in the road? I'm trying to drive. They're called Bowsers? What? What's talking about, Sally? Gas pumps are called Bowsers? That's weird. I didn't know that. I did not know that. Okay, so let's see. There should be a research station right here. And let's also, uh, pop the battery up. And... wait, didn't I have a... Wait, I made a jumper... I made a battery thing, didn't I? Yes. Yes, I did. Okay. I was gonna be a little upset. Okay. Um, so let's see. That's a fuel canister that's almost full. I don't like that air raid siren. That that doesn't sound very good to me. Shit. Alright, hold on. I think I can craft one of those. I think I can craft one of those. The nomadic hammer. I think I can craft one. Gas cylinders! I don't have a gas cylinder. I thought I picked some up. I thought I picked up a gas cylinder. Hey! Listen! Yes. Thank you, Prey Jack. Damn it. That's <laughs> Alright, you know what? I'm, I'm just going to be annoyed by this, and we're going to go. We're going we're gonna to cut our losses and head on to the next one, okay? Maybe we'll get lucky and find a gas cylinder down there. Just thrust your damn hips. Why does everybody think my... Mm. You guys know it's average, right? Like, you guys know it's average, right? Hi, Lilith. Chat's being obsessed with my Haninus again. My butts? No, no. No, 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 babe. You're talking about something very different. gonna need proof. God. Why does everybody want pictures of my dong? Gas cylinder? Gas cylinder! Hell yeah. Uh -huh. Light bulb into plastic. I uh, don't need that. But finding that gas cylinder was huge because now I can go and make another pneumatic hammer. That was what we needed for the... Okay, so I need to make a gear really fast, but I think I can make one of those easy. Okay, and then we can make a impact hammer. Perfect. Uh, okay, so you go here. Oh, I need a pry bar, too. It's called a crowbar! Okay. Uh, not the Haninus. Jeez, why do all these people want to see a funny, amazing, wonderful, and sexy woman naked? I'm none of those things, though. So we need to go around this thing, and then there should be a building over here. Yeah, there's a building right here. Okay, perfect. Okay. Wait. 
Where is the door, though? There's a door. Okay. Alright. Wait, do I have more flares? I do. Okay, so I can pry this open. Haneku is gone. It'll be back. Don't worry. It'll come back. I promise. I'm just. It's just off for right now. It's just off for right now. Not gone forever. Okay. Pry this open. Get all the good shit. Eat this. Open this. Steal all the shit. No, I don't want the locker. I want the flare. Okay, I got the flare. I was like, I want the road flare, my guy. Oh, yeah. No, now you get... Don't worry about it. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Don't stress too much, Lilith. Chat's just being their silly little selves. And chat's silly little self is... Wait, am I back outside? No. No, it's just... Okay, so that was kind of a waste. Oh, hey! I can just break out on this side, and then I don't have to go all the way around. Hell yeah! Oh, you know what actually I need to do? Deposit all that shit. Okay. Oh. Hooray, crowbar! Right? I love crowbar. Crowbar is our best friend. Crowbars are... Oh, that's a lot of garbage down there. I don't like that. I don't like that at all, man. That's bad. How you doing, Fornia? Thank you for the follow, by the way. Thank you for the follow. I hope you're having a wonderful night. I'm having a great time driving around. Driving around in my Automo car. You've been in having a very good day? Oh, well, I'm glad. That's excellent news. I'm glad to hear that. Crowbars are your, your favorite metal rod because their tools is incapable of being straight as I am. Oh. I like that. Alright, let's not drive into that. Because he lasts her exactly one minute. <laughs> Usually that doesn't happen, so you're savoring it. I'm glad you're having a good day. I like to hear when people are having good days. It makes me happy. It makes me happy that people are doing well. Okay. Grab this. It's gonna make things very unpleasant. Yoink! Mine! Run, 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 run. Well, I hope I am helping to make your day good. Okay. So next up, we gotta go here. And then we can get the fuck out. I think. Oh, I see. I'm gonna get too close. Also, get too close. So we're, we're gonna want to do a U-turn and go that way. Okay. Okay. Sorry, I'm planning my escape route. I am. I am planning my escape route. Some Hanedo always makes the day better. You think you like your general vibe? Meanwhile, your your runtime tells me you start around the point when you usually end. 
Ah, yeah, so I generally start at 11.30. And then I go until about 4 in the morning, so what time is it now? 3.30? So yeah, we'll, we'll probably be finishing about when I finish this run of, uh, like, this drive. Is about when we'll be finishing. Um, I try to go for about four and a half hours, usually. I just like streaming. It's what I do after work, so. You know. Alright, you stay here, car. You stay here. I gotta go check this research facility. At least I'm gonna try. I gotta be careful not to get got, you know? I don't want to get got, chat. Oh, really? You're going to try and lock me out, video game? Uh, oh, I don't have any flares. Shit. Alright, chat. We're going, we're going by feel here, okay? We're stealing things by feel. Oh, hey, spare crowbar. Do you like having a spare crowbar? Okay, now. How do I get out? This is how I get out. Okay, we gotta go, 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 we gotta go. Let's go. Where's my fucking car? Over here. My car is over here. Which works so hey, don't think, feel. Oh god damn it, Heidelin! Not again! <laughs> Check that out, it's almost daytime. Perfect. Okay. Okay, so now we head towards the blue dot. You got that first part mastered? What, not thinking? <laughs> Me too! Hell yeah, not thinking. I love not thinking. It's so easy. Okay. So, let's take this break. We are going to uh, give a good old fashioned a uh, yoink! Okay, this place is gonna be real mad real fast. We gotta go, 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 we gotta go. So here's the plan. We're gonna go here. And, uh, yeah. Our goal is to fucking leave! Alright, our goal is to leave. We don't need to stop for anything. We got plenty of resources back home. We just gotta skedaddle, okay? You readily lay claim to being a bimbo. Ayo. I try not to be. <laughs> and given chat th seems to think that I have a gigantic dick, I don't know if that, that qualifies. Oh, I'm gonna have to drive like right through those. Shit. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine, we're leaving. We're just leaving. We're just leaving. Don't worry about it, Zone. It's fine. Ignore the, the constant uh, everything exploding. We're just driving. We're just driving. There's no stress. It's just a normal little car trip. Right. Right. <laughs> Thinking hard makes small brain hurt. I know, right? Okay. 46 out. Oof. No, interesting thing about those anchor plugs. They use limb technology to stake down pockets of stability in an area. Basically, they delay how quickly you're turned into Swiss cheese out there. Well, I like not being Swiss cheese, ma'am. I do like not being Swiss cheese, given the option. Plenty of resources at the moment. Okay, um, let's see. 
All right, so recharge car, done. Let's see what the dumpster has for us today. What you got for me, buddy? Scrap metal, all right, coils, rubbers, rubbers? <laughs> if you know what I mean, chat. We love a good rubber, don't we? This one. It's fine, Rust Bucket would never fall. I love Frankie. She's an amazing car, okay? Okay. Did that. Uh, let me go heal myself. Boop. Do I have any paints and stuff to put away? No. Okay. Put that down. Put all this up. That back where it belongs. We'll put those right there for now. You're gay enough that you don't need a rubber to rubber. Oh my god. Yes, we do now know to look outside. Okay. Um. Repair car, fill tank. All right, let's do this first. I need two gears. I can make two gears. I can make two gears. Let's see, gear. One, two. Okay. And then this right here. Okay. Uh, matter deconstructor kit. So put this over here, I guess. Install? Sure. Alright. It's actually oh, it's like a little a little thingy. Oh. Okay. Oh, it's a little don't put your hand in there, Hanadu. <laughs> you don't want to break your new toy. Okay, so we got a matter deconstructor, which is good. Um, so let's see. Auto shop, matter deconstructor. Energy and energy efficient, economical, and probably even ethical. The matter deconstructor will recycle car components in seconds. Be careful not to get your hand caught in the suspension matrix. All right, let's see. Um, anomaly studies. Anomaly studies number six. Arda Cat Ref 3.15. Localized patches of this anomaly appeared throughout fringe areas of the zone between 1967 and 1968. Thin, waist high, grass like structures that spring up overnight. These were topped with variously colored bulbs that would frequently combust with the slightest friction. This anomaly was aggressively cold whenever it was found that has not been reported since December 1968. Poetry by Tobias B. Number one. Amongst silver bark and silver light on a chill and silent moonlit night, they came at first in groups of six, no sound, no words, no calls betwixt. With prying eyes and prying sight, they ventured left and ventured right, to pick apart the world's remains, as scavengers are lost their gains. Uh, let's see what else do we get. <clears throat> friendly dumpster. Do your eyes deceive you? Are you seeing a friendly face? Or are you anthropomorphizing garbage now? You wish you were coming with six other people? Listen, I'm, I am but one cat girl, okay? I am but one cat girl. I can only do so much. Abandoned Squire. Transmission fragment unknown. Orig origin unknown. Date unknown. Hi, I'm Gil O'Hanlon, and I'm here to tell you why the O'Hanlon Squire is the perfect sedan for all your contract needs. O'Hanlon has over a decade's experience providing utility vehicles for state and federal needs, and with the Squire, we think we've really outdone ourselves. This affordable, reliable, and easily maintained vehicle boasts excellent handling and performance thanks to its 180 cubic inch straight six engine, four speed transmission, and advanced assisted steering. This is a car that's easy to drive, easy to look after, and as comfortable as the heat of New Mexico as the freezing forest of Wisconsin. Now, come with me as I take you on a tour of what will be the government's next all best, next and best all-purpose automobile. There's a bunch of cute girls in chat to join in, that's fine. You know what, that's fair. Uh, Minuteman. 
Teletype Autoscript Arta Ref Hopper G 1140-211163. While I'm very sorry to hear that you find my anger and frustration difficult to deal with, even intimidating, but I wonder if you'd react the same way if any of your male colleagues came to you with similar complaints or dissatisfaction. I've been on hold for two hours, and I'm calling to warn you of a new danger that is vi isn't very much everyone's in everyone's interest to know about do you understand no listen to me write this down we're seeing more and more anomalies capable of electrogenesis of producing electricity like an eel or a ray but at remarkable levels this is enormously dangerous and i don't care about what secrets Arda wants to keep this is about people's safety their lives this has nothing to do with me trying to muscle in on research or put myself back on some half-assed program it's about you idiots understanding the risks you're hiding from people. Now, let me send this data through. Oh, you want me to talk about theories? How about on limb and wave interpolation or Patel's theory that Arda have twisted half the peninsula into some kind of Klein bottle where the inside is now the outside as well? Or do you want me to... Do you want to put me through to somebody who act, who's actually interested in making things happen? That's a baby engine. I just hope you guys are enjoying my stupid... Um, dialogue for this. Happy hair. Journal fragment data known. Over the past year, I've seen anomalies cause all manner of chaos. I've seen them dismantle art facilities, dissolve trucks in a puddle of goo, and even tear human beings apart. I've seen the fruits of our labors turn one of the prettiest parts of the country into one of the most dangerous and unpredictable. Always enjoy my stupid... <gasps> nice. But this week, I saw the first sign that things might change. I caught a rare glimpse of hope. Perhaps not everything we've unleashed here in this gigantic cosmic accident has been bad. We've logged several sightings of a new anomaly. At first sight, it matches the description of so many others, but this one is different. It actually repairs things, apparently seeking out damaged material and not in a way not dissimilar to some of our own prototype. And you're generating it in a way not entirely dissimilar to some of our prototype technology. It is benign, even friendly, and I'm starting to wonder if it even communicates. My stupid is best stupid. Hello, Grom Falloon. How are you? How was Silent Hill? Can we do a shout out for a Mr. Grom Falloon? Disruptive discharge. The electrical discharge detected in this part of the zone can damage and disrupt batteries, draining your power reserves. Thank you for doing the shout out. How you doing, Grumbo? Okay, so we have this thing. Okay. Totally not scary at all. Mm. Fair. Alright, what do we need for this? Fucking electronics. We need six steel sheets for that. Wait. Outfitting station. Upgrading cars is one thing, but now it's time to spend a few of those zone resources upgrading yourself. Go on, you deserve it. Pretty clunk, pretty alright game, nice and clunky, terrible voice acting, looks like a PS2 game that plays like a PS1 solid stuff. It's, it's a game. Grounded sweater. Oh, I can make balloon shirt! Speaking of Grom Falloon. Uh, a very rudimentary solution to many zaps and shocks might suffer in the zone. This will do for now, but definitely needs further mod modification. Uh, sure. Wearing. Equipment. Grounded sweater. Designed to both insulate the wearer and divert discharges, this somewhat re this will somewhat reduce the effects of harmful electrical exposure. It may be scratchy and have a copper trim that literally grounds you, but it could make all the difference when it, your body completes a circuit. How's the drive? I like this game so far. It's kind of a good vibe. It's 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 nice and chill, I guess. Uh, let's see. Medium- <gasps> Medium backpack! This backpack modification offers a little more space for you to squeeze together all the many curiosities you'll find in the zone, as well as more pockets for quick access to items. With a little more time and resources, you may be able to enlarge it further. Alright. But I need a bunch of shit for that. <gasps> I have two more quick slots! Oh, and it's bigger! Nice! All right, what else can I make? Uh, matter regenerator. Mm -hmm. But yeah, I'm enjoying this game. It's 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 a vibe. Like it's very uh, like it puts me to sleep ish, but it's not bad. Like it's fun. So you know. 
All right, what's this? Vargas Auto Pack of Act. The addition of sorting system will take your tidy present to a more organized future. The transfer trunk will be filled with collect items before being deposited. I see. So what do we need here? We need six steel sheets for that. Oh, let's go make six steel sheets. I think that's more important. But yeah, I'm having fun with it. I'm having fun with it. All right, let's see. One, two, three, four, five, six. Cool, cool. You love vibes? Hey, yo. Okay, let's go upgrade our locker. Hell yeah, we got ourselves another lock. Ooh, it's a big one. It's a big one, chat. <laughs> Hell yeah. Expanded locker. This way? This way. Hell yeah, look at that chat, look at that. Suddenly we have all the extra fucking storage space. Okay, so we need a detailing station next. Uh, okay. And it was big hard locker. <laughs> Clay didn't know what vibes meant in a certain context, so that explaining it to her was quite an ambush, or quite amusing. Aw. Language barrier, Grom? Was that like a language barrier thing? So let's see, detailing station. What do I need for that? Detailing station. Uh, I need more electronics, damn. Uh, a little bit? Okay. Yeah. Matter regenerator. Okay. We can make a matter regenerator. Uh, okay, then I guess we put this here. <clears throat> She's not perfect when it comes to slang and stuff. I mean... Like, when English isn't your first language, there's a lot that you, like, have to learn about that sort of thing, you know? Okay. Lockbook. Equipment. Medium backpack. We've already read that. Overburdened with equipment? Dropping all your resources? Sewing a little more carrying capacity into your backpack could be the substantial help. One of humanity's finest and greatest celebrations was surely the shelf. Celebrate these wonderful inventions by arranging several of them in order before neatly fronting them with some doors, and make the whole thing bigger than the previous version you had. Exciting, isn't it? Matter regenerator. Ingenious limb technology and advanced spectrum mechanical acoustics are used to repair car components stored in the station while you're out on a drive. Oh, cool. I like that. English is a perfectly sane and logical language? Uh, yeah, obviously. Let's update our backpack. I don't know what this is updating, but it's certainly updating. It's certainly an upgrade. <laughs> I'm just not quite sure what for. So what does this thing do? Vargas Auto Back. Building. What's the point of inventing all these new technologies if you can't use them to screw things up a little? Wait. Okay, so I, that, that's... Oh, it's, it's a... Oh, that's pretty cool! It puts everything... Okay, cool. So it deposits... Alright, cool. Cool, I like it. Okay, let's see. What can we make over here? What is this? No. Backseat tank. So let's see. Hi, D. How are you? Hi, Silver. How are you? Hi, JC. How are you? How are you guys all doing? All right, let's, uh, so let's see. If I want to install... All right, let's see about getting better tires. I think that's the next step, is getting better fucking tires. All right, we can still do... Hmm. A regular headlight? What is it? Side floodlights? Hmm. So what does this do? So, auto parker, jump jacks, 
Resource radar, juke jet, hmm. ion shield. You know what? Let's fabricate. Let's see. Hmm. And you more unstable. Oh, I need an unstable energy for that. Hello, doing good. We're lurking while doing war from ground. Hell yeah, alive. Hope the stream is doing good so far. It has. I don't know what the upgrade does. Is I think you can pull that lever from the beginning. I think that it just makes it like have a bigger suction radius. Maybe I, I don't know. I'm not sure. Uh, so let's see. So we need electronics for that. We need more steel sheets for that, which we've kind of used all of these up. I need a circuit board and scrap metal, which I don't have any more of. This we need... Okay, so we're, we're kind of hitting that point where I have uh, outmoded my shenanigans a little bit. Hi, Nox. What's up? What can I do for you, man? What can I do for you, buddy old pal, little friend of mine? What can I do you for? Thank you for doing the shout out. Everybody go check out Nox, he's a cool dude. All right, let's see, insulated door, armored door, or lead plated, eh. All right, I kind of want to get the backseat tank. Pfft, Jesus. Meowdy. What's up, Nox? How you been? Okay, so that's all the upgrades we can do right now. Why is this... I still don't know what to do with this. Unreliable fix none. Uh, you beat that gravity bat- Ah, oh, fuck yeah! Congratulations, dude! Congratulations! That's fucking awesome! <laughs> Just shat out a whole fucking door. Alright, well, thanks for the door, my guy. I mean, I don't really- I didn't really need a door. Did I? I don't need a door. Here, you know what? We can try matter deconstructing this door and see what happens. Go, oh, Jesus! Uh, let me know if you want the spoiler, otherwise I'll send it my hands. Uh, I don't need any spoilers just yet. But congratulations! Every time I hear Hinox, I think of the enemy from the... Oh, yeah. How's the driving been going? This game looks neat. This game has very much a vibe. Like, if that makes sense. It's very vibe. Um, it's not bad. It's just, it's very calming. I think my biggest problem was playing it during the, uh, birth anniversary. Oh. Was during, playing it during the birth anniversary because, like, it kind of put me to sleep. But now that I'm just kind of enjoying it, you know, it's actually, like, a whole lot of fun. actually a lot of fun. Okay, hold on. Let me let me read this logbook stuff real fast. Okay, so wheels. Off-road tire. These specialized treads may seem oversized and clumsy, but they offer welcome extra traction in the wet and the mud. Backseat fuel tank. Sure, the safest and most interference-free place to put this may be on the back, a back seat, but it sure makes the car reek of gasoline. Furthermore, it's somewhat limited in its capacity being about half the size of a regular tank. Still, maybe you can add more tanks later. Um, but yeah, it's pretty good so far. It's pretty good so far. Having a good time. I'm having a lo a good time. Um, damn it. Still need stuff for this. I can at least make one of these again. Because this thing's fucking nice. This thing's so nice. Alright. Um, 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 do we have any repair potty laying around? I think there's a repair buddy in the back seat. Yeah, it's a very comfy game, definitely. Like, n no questions asked. Very, 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 very comfy. Alright, what are we looking at? Oof. 
A lot of things need adjusting. Alright, uh, let's grab the spackle and get spackling! I've already visited the friendly dumpster, so I don't know why it keeps telling me to. My only worry right now is that when I leave, I'm gonna be like, oh hey, I need to redo a bunch of this crap. Because when we loaded it up today, it seemed like it didn't save a lot of this. So that's the only thing I'm worried about. That said, um... I think we're at the end here. But yeah, congratulations on beating the bastard. That's awesome. I'm super happy for you. That dude uh, sucked. Right, we can give a little bit. I mean, this is still green. This is fine. Put that away. Put that away. Our little fuel can is doing just fine. Can I fill you up? All right. Um, what time is it? Yeah, I think this is this is like a perfect spot to stop. Um, it keeps telling me to visit the friendly dumpster. I've already visited. What more is he gonna give me? Scrap metal. Actually, now that I'm thinking about it, you know what we can do? Crunch this up. How did you beat him? Out of curiosity. The dumpster can have multiple gifts. That's why it's not kicked off. Yeah, I know. I know. But yeah, how did you how did you end up beating him? Out of curiosity. Pickaxe, half a door for a shield, and other me. Uh yeah, that's that's about the strategies that a lot of people have to do is to just fucking tank his ass. You know, you just have to get a big fucking shield that negates all of his fucking damage and just tank his stupid ass. It's... Oh, man, I want that steel panel. It's not fun, but, you know, it's what you end up having to do. And, you know... If it works, it works, right? At the end of the day... It's... Did Phase 1 solo summon other me at the start of Phase 2? Ah, that's risky, I will say. Summoning in the start of Phase 2 is always very risky. It works out, though. But yeah, congratulations. That's awesome. I'm glad you uh, you managed to down the fucker. Okay, still nothing there. Okay, it's fine. Nothing. All right. Is there anything else that I can craft that'll be useful for me? Anchor radar. Um. Did we have this before? Chat, did we have this before? I think this is new. I think this is new. I need more... I need gears for that. But I can only make one, so... I don't have the electronics for that. I don't know if you had it before, but I think that one is handheld. Then I guess... No, then no, I didn't. Then there's no way I did. Okay. Hmm. I mean, I can make one and see what it is. Oh, look. be under equipment? No. Listen, I'm just happy I got a bigger backpack. Jesus. Tools? Anchor radar. Okay, so... Alright, anything else I can make that's useful? 
I really want to get this liberator. I just keep forgetting. Like, I just don't have the stuff for it. I need more thermosap crystals. Which are a pain, because I can't get them. <sighs> I guess I could make another steel door. I could, pro I could make a steel door and put it on the, like, the passenger side, I guess. Okay, so R to take this off. Uh, pick this up. Install. Pick this up. Okay, those are all full, so like... I can just demolish this fucking thing. Right? I can just demolish this thing. And it puts them all in the transfer trunk. That's pretty cool. I like that. No, god damn. There we go. Okay, good enough. Good enough. Good enough. And that's everything there. Okay. I don't have enough for that. I mean, I might. Hold on. Do I have enough, do I have enough to make a shield sheet? I can make a couple more steel. I can make some more steel sheets, which means that I can potentially make... Oh, I can make this backseat tank instead. And then I can go and install this over here. Hell yeah. Alright, alright. Do you have any gas in you? I got a little bit of gas in you. Okay, hold on. Let's see, let's see. Can I put this, can I fill this up? I can! Nice! Hi, BD, how are you? So how much does this thing hold? That holds, okay, so interesting. Interesting, interesting, interesting. All right, we're learning, we're learning, we're learning. Oops, that was, my keyboard is so fucking sensitive. All right, and then, so this, why does it keep telling me to fill the tank? Oh, I guess because this thing counts now and it wants me to fill the whole goddamn thing. Wait, oh, okay, I see. Does this count? Can I use this to fill this? No. Can I... Hold on, can I... I don't ha I don't understand how this works. Unless it just- it just uses the- okay, never mind. I see the tube. I see- I see the tube when you highlight over it, so it's actually a part of the, okay, okay, I get it now. So, basically, all of the tanks that are attached to it count towards the fullness of the gas cap tank. I understand the, I'm understanding. My, my brain is, in fact, expanding uh, with knowledge. My brain is expanding with knowledge. I'm, I'm learning. It's just taking me a minute, because I'm, I'm um, fucking stupid. Because I'm I'm fucking stupid. <laughs> yeah, I'm doing good. I'm learning the secrets of the car reverse. I am. I am. I think I just need I need more side storage is what I need. I don't think I need more side fuel tanks. Cause like the backseat tank. So I think I think in terms of like storage stuff, we need more side racks. But I'm seeing I don't know. I'm not seeing a, um... I, I just want more, 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 more storage, I guess, so that we can do, like, 
the longer that we can do these things, the better, you know? Fuel synthesizer. Possibly absorbs, be sure to siphon it regularly. Oh, that's interesting. Hmm. Interesting. Scan an art of fuel tanker. Advanced workshop two. Yeah, I think we need to start working on this crap. Getting the advanced workbench and stuff, but a lot of it's going to require like going further and further out because you can see this one requires unstable energy, and then like I think even further stuff is going to require corrupt energy, but we can't even see that yet because it's so far out there, you know. So yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, one last thing I want to check, which is this. So. I'm guessing that, like, once we get these, they just replace the old one, question mark? Because, okay, so, like, this one is lead radiation. Radiation is 20, then 40, then it's 40, plus it blocks radiation. So, similarly, like, this sweater is 30% electrical resist. This adds, sh uh, blocks shocks, and then this is electrical 45. So, I'm guessing that, like, these are, like, they go up in tiers... Anti-theft backpack. Wait, who's gonna be stealing my shit? Theft is a thing? Never have an item stolen from your grass ever again. Thanks to Hmm. Interesting. Interesting. Hmm. Hmm. Alright, I think again, biggest thing, Swamp Coral 200. I haven't even seen Swamp Coral yet. They're all permanent linear ones? Okay. The ones that I think that aren't permanent linear ones are like the side racks on the car because you can swap that shit out. But it looks like everything else is like, once you get it, you just have it, you know? Cause like, say the side storage, like the expansion racks, once you've got them, you know? Uh. Excuse me. But yeah, we need more we need more energy, so we, we can't really do much else right now. Okay. I think And our car doesn't seem to have much in the way of wait, what's blinking? Why is it blinking? Why are you blinking, dear? Were you blinking because the door was open? Were you mad because the tailgate was up? Huh? Were you mad because the door was open? You snarky little bitch. All right, uh, I guess I'm gonna make one jumper so that it stops yelling at me. Because it keeps yelling at me to make a battery jumper, and then I'm gonna put this on the side with all of my anti, like, emergency crap. Okay. Close the door. And then we're gonna have to start going to, to other places soon because we're gonna we're gonna be running out of out of stuff. But I'm going to uh, save the game. I'm gonna save the game right here. Okay, game has been saved. Hopefully, hopefully that means I don't have to redo all this crap that we just did because we did a lot of like in menu stuff, and hopefully I don't have to redo it. Anyway, that's gonna be where we call this. So, you know.